it is bright and early. Not even bright, it is dark and early. It is, what time is it? Let me see, check my watch, which is about to die. I didn't charge it last night. It's 3.32 a.m. I am at indoor parking at the airport. I'm waiting on the shuttle bus to get here. The guy says it's gonna be a couple minutes. And yeah, so I just got here. Y'all, I passed like five car accidents on the way here. Like, it was crazy. Everybody, please be careful and safe on the road because it was like bad. They were like really bad accidents too, so. I'm just waiting on um, the shuttle right now. And once we get inside the airport and sit down, I will be back to talk to you guys. So see you in the next clip. I got here at like noon, 11 something, but check-in isn't until three, so I couldn't come into my room until three. So I hung out by the pool, went to lunch, had a drink, went back to the pool, and like felt like passed out, laying on one of the um, like beach bed little things for like an hour, no joke, and woke up drenched in sweat because it's so hot, but like feels really good and like detoxy. So this is great lighting. So I have this huge window right here. So I'm not gonna do like a room tour because it's nothing special to be honest. Um, it's not like I'm staying at like some luxury resort or something. It's just an all-inclusive Wyndham resort. Um, but the like community, like resort amenities are super A1. So that is what's most important. And then I have a room with AC that is on full blast right now and will remain on full blast until I leave because it is so hot. And um, yeah, I'm about to get changed, but I'm waiting on one of the um, guys who works here to come back because I don't have any toilet paper in my bathroom. Really weird. So waiting on that, but at the same time, my my building is kind of far back, so I might be able to change this place out. I'm about to do some like skincare and put on some SPF. So let me do that. I'm gonna see where I can sit, you guys, where it's not gonna be like terrible lighting. And these things. Well, first, let me show you guys while I have you here, and I have this mirror, which is a vibe. What I um wore to the airport. So this was my airport outfit. I have on this little crop top that's like cinched in the center and it's like a knit kind of material. No bra, one second. Thank you. All right, toilet paper's here. So this little, I feel like it's a lot sad. He's gone. This little top has like a crop top. Um, these aren't supposed to be tied, but this top was so loose on my shoulders. I felt like my whole boob was about to fall out. So I was like, I gotta tie these shoulders. So I tied it over there and over there. And then I have on these really cute high-waisted like linen pants. So that was a vibe, super comfy to travel in. Then I had on these like dad sandals that I don't have strapped right now because I kept taking them on and off at the pool and stuff. And then I had my hair just in this ponytail with it just like twisted in the front. Um, a mask on and everything like that so you, you couldn't see my face. And then these are the jewels that I had on. What you can't see. Okay. 
this one, my little cross, and then my Celine dupe. And then just all these bracelets that I got from Shein. And then um, my Apple Watch, which died because I didn't charge it last night. And my little Jador um, dupe knit bracelet so yeah that's what i went to the airport got a lot of looks i was very confused i was like am i overdressed like i wasn't though but i definitely am dressed for the beach i'm glad i wore this though because i wasn't able to get into my room right away but this was still like cool enough for me to be like not dying you know but it's definitely time to get out of this because i've sweat through this like a crazy person so and i look not too bad in this so that's exciting like, I feel like it looks really flattering on my body, too. I don't look like a fatty, so that's exciting for me. Okay, I'm about to get switched into the bathing suit I'm gonna wear today and show you guys that. Hey guys, okay, so I'm still getting ready to go back to the beach. I keep checking my watch for my, the time, but I don't have my Apple watch on, but it's dead. Um, something I need to do, put on face SPF. <laughs> Y'all, I swear y'all cannot see. There's a little bottom in, but I still feel like it's very low. It is, okay. I have it. I have a thing. I'm just being lazy. Something else about this hotel, the Wi-Fi is super spotty, but in your actual hotel room, it's so, so good. Which is like, Probably the most important place to have good Wi-Fi, because I mean, like, screw it if you don't have good Wi-Fi down on the beach or something, whatever. You're at the beach and you're just like drinking or whatever. Anyway, it's like, you know. Um, but you don't have good Wi-Fi um, in your room, and then when you like come back at night and you're just like trying to go to sleep or whatever, and is that decent? Kinda. It's a weird angle. And you're trying to go to sleep or whatever. Um, if you can't like watch Netflix or something, that is really impressive. Okay, so this is the bathing suit. This is not so wrong. This side. Oh, girl. This, this is like, I feel like I'm going to tie this in the back though because of how the salon is happening, you know? So maybe let's shut that. Just move this up. And then this. One thing I do hate though is showing my freaking belly button. I hate my belly button. I just feel like it shouldn't be exposed. Um, I don't think it's ugly or anything. I just don't like belly buttons. So that's that. I also kind of need to wash in my feet, but at the same time, my feet just came out. Hope no one saw my nip. Um, but at the same time, I Look is kind of pointless because I really have to spread this oil out. <laughs> I swear to God, bro. Oh, Jesus Lord, this top. <sighs> I don't know why it's like that. I don't know why it's like that, okay? It's just like the, the straps are too big on the top for some reason. really 
really feel like this is risque. This bathing suit is like tripping me out right now. I don't really know what to do to help it, you know? guys we are on our way to the beach don't know i hate walking past like um hotel rooms i just feel like one of my biggest fears is abduction and i just feel like it would be so easy to abduct someone walking past a hotel room so <laughs> me having to walk past all these doors right now i'm just like a little bit on edge and then it always is startling if someone like opens it when you're right there it scares the crap out of you but yeah, I'm walking to the beach now. I'm like on the back side of this building. I literally have to walk the entire thing through like one path to back to like the amenities and stuff. So, yeah. But I have to go to the office right now. I was trying to call them, but they weren't answering the phone. So I gotta go to the office right now because I need to schedule my COVID test that I have to have to get back into America. So, let's go to the desk and do that. I do not like how when they clean the rooms, they like have the doors open. That is so nerve wracking. It just, it seems wrong. I have to tell myself that I'm not in the USA and people do things differently. Like in the taxi on the way here, girl, the door to the taxi just was just left open. The whole ride just to have like a breeze, which like was nice, but at the same time, it's like, this is dangerous. So yeah. It's kind of over Cassie right now, um, but I think the sun's going to come back out. Hopefully it doesn't start raining, but even if it does, the lady, I was talking to one of the employees earlier and she said that when it does rain, it does it for like a couple minutes and then it stops and then it's gone. And it was kind of like scattered and then like 40 to 50% pretty much every day that I'm here. So if it just has like one quick little shower or whatever, that's fine. That's whatever. And I mean, that's pretty normal. For the beach in general so yeah my feet are hurting like I just, I just done a lot of walking and stuff today just through the airports and everything and now i have on these like flat sandals when earlier i had on like some chunky dad sandals so they have more support so i wasn't feeling it in those but now that i have on these little thin sandals girl so yeah, we're gonna go to the beach. So we're gonna go schedule our COVID test, then go to the beach, take a couple Instagram pics, and then I'm just gonna read and chill out and relax. Also earlier, the playlist they had going was crazy. So that was nice. So yeah, I'll hit back with you guys when we get to the beach. You guys can see me try to take pics. I'll probably fail, but like, it's fine. Ooh, I thought there was a bug in my face. I do that all the time. Oh, oh my God. What the fuck right now? Yeah, I'm okay. Right, thank you.
so pretty. Oh, I love the beach. I love a relaxing beach vacation. Like, I'm not the person to go to the beach and get like turned. I want to go to the beach and just like chill, relax. That's what I'm doing right now. Like, I don't even have to get in the water. Like, I feel fine not doing that. <laughs> I just want to have a swimsuit on, be at the water, feel the breeze. Like, oh, yes, yeah, take some cute pics and like read. Like, I've read so much today. I'm probably about to read some more. Make it on my own, so call me on the phone, and we can talk about it all.